Hello, scholars. Today is Thursday. We have um, some math that we're going to be doing. So we have been focusing on subtraction and taking away. But the thing that we worked on before we started this uh, were number sentences and number bonds. We are now going to incorporate that into our lesson. So, as you can see on Mr. Spivey's dry erase board, I have my number bond, my number sentence, and a few balls that we're going to use to help us solve our problem. So, first of all, Mr. Spivey is going to tell you a quick little story about him playing with his friends um, some different sports outside. So, Mr. Spivey bought four balls along. He had a football, soccer ball, baseball, and a tennis ball. Now, we were playing outside, and we were playing football. And one of Mr. Spivey's friends threw... Well, actually, first, let's count how many balls I have. I have one, two, three, four. So, if we remember correctly... We always put my whole number in this box right here that has the two legs coming off of it. So I have four balls right now on my board. Now, let's get into the story. We were playing football first, and one of Mr. Spivey's friends, they were so, so strong that they threw the football all the way um, into the woods. And we couldn't find the football. So we lost my football. Sad face. And then we decided to play, oh, we were going to play some baseball. And would you know what Mr. Spivey got up to bat? And he hit the baseball so hard that it flew over some mountains. So we lost our baseball. Okay? So... We are going to look at our number bond now. We had four balls to start with, right? And then we lost two. Mr. Spivey's friend threw the football over into the woods. And then I hit that baseball so hard it went flying who knows where. So, we lost two balls. So I gotta take two balls and put two there. How many balls do we have left over? Perfect, we have two. We have the soccer ball and the tennis ball. So we have two. So now we are going to put this into our number sentence. So remember, this is our minus sign and this is our equal sign. We're going to put our four over here because that's how many balls we started with. Um, we lost two balls when we were playing, so we put a two there. And then equals two, because we have two balls left over. All right, so friends, that's what you're going to do on your homework today. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I hope you guys are uh, starting to understand this. Um, until next time, scholars, I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye, friends.